temps and I did not feel my allergies were that bad. Oh, good. Yeah. All right. Maybe keeping them in check. A lot of folks wouldn't agree with you with the <laughs> allergy thing, but I think a lot of folks are definitely with you on the 80s and the yep. beautiful weather, right? Mm -hmm. We enjoyed it too. And we had low humidity, so that's what made it so nice to be out and feel sticky like it usually does when we get these warmer numbers. And yeah, it makes you feel a little bit like summer. Yeah, these folks enjoying Sunday afternoon on the Loose Lake. Boy, what a crowd there. Can you tell a lot of folks are excited about the weather? A gorgeous sunset as well. You know, we've got one more day of 80s, a little bit of a treat, and then they'll be coming to an end as we get temperatures more in line with what is normal, which is in the 70s. We do have some showers in our forecast for Tuesday. There's also a chance we could have some thunder with that, and we do cool down by the middle to latter half of the week. A high temperature this afternoon was 81 degrees, so definitely above our normal of 74 and we're going to see 86 tomorrow so that'll be the warmest of our streak yet and then we'll get a little bit cooler by Tuesday and then definitely those numbers are down behind that front with highs in the 70s for the rest of the week we are still hanging on to a couple 70s out there right now it's 71 degrees in Winston-Salem we have 67 in Moxville 68 in Ashboro and right now 68 in Yanceyville temperatures are in the 60s from North Wilkesboro to Rhonda to a 69 there in Pilot Mountain and temperature around 60 degrees in Sparta. Tomorrow morning we will wake up with sunshine. It may be back to work for you, back to school for students. You've got temps in the 50s to start and even close to 60 degrees in the Piedmont Triad. And if you're up really early tomorrow morning, specifically at 5.07 a.m., you can check out the International Space Station. It will pass overhead. There's a four minute pass. It'll be pretty high in the sky, about 66 degrees above the horizon. And we do have perfect viewing conditions. We have clear skies in our forecast and we have comfortable temperatures. High pressure is the reason we've had so much sun. It's also the reason that we've had those temperatures getting warmer by day. We've got 85, 86 degrees tomorrow afternoon southwest wind at about 5 to 10 miles an hour so again low humidity and lots of sun for the foothills high temperature also mid 80s south breeze is starting off in the upper 50s and your monday forecast in the mountains is warm too with temperatures in the upper 70s. Next chance of rain is this front to the west is moving kind of slowly. It's bumping into all of that hot air that is across the eastern half of the nation, but this is going to give way. Ridge will break down and this front will eventually get into our area, so it brings with it a chance of rain. There wasn't a whole lot of severe weather with it today. There's a real small chance you could have some isolated severe storms tomorrow in places like Nashville down toward Jackson, Mississippi, and then Storm Prediction Center actually does not have us in a severe category for uh, Tuesday right now. They just have kind of general thunderstorms as a possibility that could change. We'll keep a close eye on it. I do think we have the potential for some heavy rain for many of those cells that do develop and maybe some damaging wind gusts. Of course, we'll watch that early Tuesday morning. We're just starting to get some of the clouds and rain inching in and then by afternoon. This is after lunchtime. You start to see at least a few discrete cells sort of developing there. So that is a possibility coming up later this week. Of course, Merle Fest starts at campus of Wilkes Community College. Great forecast so far with just a small chance of rain expected by late Sunday. Here is your seven day forecast in the triad. Cooler on Wednesday with a high of 70 and then those temperatures will stay in the 70s with mainly dry skies into the weekend. All right, thanks, Lady.